I'm zoom in a little bit yeah, closer. I, I've got her zoomed in. Yeah. You will see its little. Yeah, yeah, I see her sucking it up. Yeah. Let me see. Yeah, 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 she's drinking. Because you got to think where they live in the middle of the desert, there's the only time they'll ever drink is when it rains, you yeah, know? This one is spoiled. What kind of bird is it? Bulbul. A bulbul? Bulbul. 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 And you guys, did you guys find it? I will. Man, this is beautiful, man. A non venomous. No, a venomous. Oh, a okay, a venomous, yeah. Man, this is a beautiful home, Mike. Uh, yeah, we will put a buffet out. So people just get their plate and get the buffet. We have drinks over there. And then in this section here, we put those tables out with six chairs around the table. Sure. And the guys can go sit there at the table and enjoy their lunch. This is beautiful. Where did you get these paintings? This is beautiful. It's a local guy. He, uh, he does uh, in Madrid. Beautiful house. And and this house has been here since the 60s. Yeah. So, when I was working in West Africa, I got all those dollars. Sure. I built my training center. Uh-huh. And the house was up to where it was last wall. Oh, so this is all it's renovated. This one. Okay. So oh, Victor. What? What? Come, come, check him out. Yeah. No, 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 no. He just wants to show you. Check it out. <laughs> I knew I knew you were gonna do that. I knew that. Yeah. I can take a closer picture for you. Oh yeah, he's all hooded, you know. And the, uh, you just, just take press, a picture just this, yeah, this. Yeah. You just press that camera button on he's, the side. It's taking yeah. a video for now. But it'll take a awesome. picture. You could take a picture while taking a video. You say it's a what? A file, a file, file snake. File snake. Okay. Okay. okay, so like kind of like a king snake. They are yeah? immune. Yeah, they eat mambas, they eat cobras, but it's immune against anything. They don't have anything at all. Okay. But they immune to that. Victor, just put one finger right there. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no. Okay. Okay. Babies, you can't really see the difference when they're babies. But when they're bigger, the scales and stuff on them is much, much bigger when they grow up. She's rearing a little bit, yeah. Move this little one. Then this is a brown water snake. This one will be in this snake. And the one. <laughs> so those are baboon teeth right there. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he's not very really happy. That's good. Yeah, you have that on video. Very fast, eh? Yeah, that's fast, bro. Look at that little hood. Yeah, I didn't know they had hoods like that. Mm. It's very, very small, but still. Yeah. Good. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cool. Almost like a cobra, man. Yeah. yeah. That's why people mistake and say it's a cobra and it's not a cobra. Man, angry. He is fucking angry, <laughs> man. 
little bit, not too much. Those guys are chilling. He's just chilling. Yeah, that actually relaxing inside there. He's quite a big guy. Yeah, he had a bit of a bath yesterday. So yeah, he's not very happy. <laughs> not much space to work with, you know. What is that right there? It's a Cape Cod, the most venomous of the Southern African Cobras. Very potent and toxic venom. Really, the Cape Cobra is? Mm. Yeah. The two snakes that cause fatalities in South Africa is uh, the Cape Cobras and the Black Mambas. Is another one. Many color varieties on those guys. This guy's made me <laughs> mess on himself. <laughs> This one. Oh my gosh, man. That just calms him right down going into there. Yeah, the HUD? Yeah, this one did you Yeah, this is a snouted cobra, very common snake around this area. We used to call them Egyptian cobras, those relatives of the Egyptian cobra. I, I've seen them at a zoo and they had a tag and it said Egyptian cobra, that same snake. But they don't call them Egyptian cobras anymore. No? It is the Egyptian cobra, right? but the one we find in so did you, I mean, not aggressive, just scared, yeah? Well, that snake is just defending himself. Sure, yeah. sure. If I throw you out of your bed, you're not going to be happy chappy either. Right, <laughs> right. So right. that's just what this guy is doing now, he's not too happy. So this, you can see, he's got bands on the body. Light and dark bands on sure, the body. Sure, sure. It's just the color phase that you get in these snakes. <laughs> Come on. Yeah, that. Yes, yeah, I know you're upset. Are you jumping? Yeah. I get annoyed. Let's see if I can get into it. You see, they're starting to inflate them. Sure, sure. They puff it up, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So they just do that to make themselves look. Bigger than they are. Oh, oh shit, yep. <laughs> but is it pretty rare to get a, a bite by one of these guys? Yeah. Like, if you if you handle that snake now, now it's, it's not in a happy mood. Um, then you are risking a bite. But normally a lot of people handle these snakes. Free, free handle. handle them, you know. It's just not worth it though, you know? I mean, you see all those guys on YouTube, but it's like, what's the point, right? You yeah. know? Yeah. Sure, maybe maybe it's one in a thousand, but one in a thousand. Yeah. Now, are they, long, are they long strikers, like gaboons or puff outers or no, not really? Um, they would probably strike half their body length. What they normally do is they puff themselves up like this and then they might just bring that puffed up body into an S shape like this. And, then they and okay, okay. Yeah, so they can e easily use half their body length to strike. But yeah, as I said, you know, it's not normally. Do you know, I mean, how many bites a year are actually require anti venom for, for boom slang? I reckon that if you go into a hospital with a bloom slung bite, the chances that you need antivenom will probably be in the region of 80%. Sure. A small percentage you can probably get by with blood transfusion that you don't need antivenom. Really? Yeah. yeah. The snake didn't inject enough venom. Oh, uh, okay. So like a warning bite, bite or something. Yeah, just a little bit of venom, yeah. Okay. But uh, if this snake bites you, it's a serious emergency. It is. It's very potent venom. Um, 
even the antivenom, when they, they say when they start a fresh horse to start making To make the, the antivenom, yeah? The horse gets terribly sick from this one. Really? Yeah, even, even in microscopic amounts? Yeah. They must be very careful how they, how they start that program. Because they could kill the horse. They can. And it doesn't look like much, you know? It's yeah, crazy. It's very, very nondescript. Now, you've heard, obviously, of the American scientist that got bit and documented his death on the boom slang. Paul Schmidt. Paul Schmidt. Paul Schmidt, yeah. And he... Chicago yeah. Museum of Natural History, yes. Yeah. And he's, is he one of the only known deaths of a boom slang? Mm. No. Oh, no, no. There, so there has been deaths, yeah. Yeah, no, no. There are also deaths recorded from them. I think I think there was at least one fatality I know of last year. And here in South Africa. In South Africa. Yeah. Yeah. How, it may be farm workers or what? People working and picking fruit or what? This particular guy, actually, I think now, now, to, now I come to think of it, I think there might have even been two now. Now the, the one. The one guy I know of, um, he was actually a snake catcher. Do you remember? Oh, nice. You just, did you breed these here? Yeah. I think we've got a little yellow deer. Also, my old venomous, but you can like, eat frogs and stuff like that. Oh, a night adder, isn't it? Yeah. What's your personal favorite snake? Uh, I like mambas. Yeah. And, uh, the green mamba is such a pretty snake. It really is. Oops. Almost climbed out. The boom slangs can be extremely beautiful too, they, yeah? They can be, yeah, but they haven't got the... The nice head and graceful that, The coffin head. shaped head, yeah. yeah and just even even at that at, even at that size, still extremely deadly, yeah. Well, the quantity of venom is not gonna be enough to kill you. So it, you mean if you took a bite from one of those baby green mambas? Yeah, I think you can ride it out. Without anti venom? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Golan Horseman. What is this? The Black House Snakes. What's that right there? It's a house snake. Oh, it's a house? Yeah. What do you do with?